Polar Bear knows what to do when it's time for the open classroom. Blue Bear is sitting behind the green line, but her friends might just be sitting on the floor or sitting in the chair. She's definitely able to see the computer and see her teacher when she first comes because they like to do some movement. Lifting your tail, hidey roo. Lifting your tail, hidey roo. When everybody is done with their movement, the teacher will probably get to sing, Good morning, Blue Bear. Good morning, Ruth. Good morning, everyone. We're glad you're here today. Now it's time for everyone to choose a work. Hmm, Blue Bear is going to go get out a work rug. She has the idea to use a puzzle right now. Looking at the workshop. Uh-huh, this is the puzzle you want to use, right? Okay. Blue Bear's going to work on this puzzle. Do you remember how to do it, Blue Bear? Yep, you got it. When she's done, she puts it back on the shelf. Blue Bear's friends might have different things at their house and different things on their shelf. Whatever's on your shelf is what you can choose from. If she's done, she rolls up her work mat. If she wants to do another work on her work rug, she can leave it out. Okay, back in its place if you're done. Now Blue Bear has noticed that there's some lovely white paper. This is a work we do at the table. With her colored pencils, she sits down to do some drawing. Blue Bear, what are you going to draw today? Ooh, some curved lines, some squiggly lines. Mm, I wonder what your friends will draw if they choose coloring. Okay, when you're finished, you'll put it away. Oh, you still are working. Blue Bear can work by herself. Her parents might be working on their work. Her sister's over working on some different work. Oops. Blue Bear knows, just like in the classroom, you can be working near a friend without interrupting. Same thing when we're having an open classroom at home. We can let our family do their work and we can do ours. Oops, sorry, Blue Bear. I didn't mean to bump you, are you okay? That was an accident. When Blue Bear hears this special sound, she knows to stop and listen. She even looks over at the teacher. Blue Bear, where's the teacher? Over there at the computer. The teacher is inviting friends to come and hear a story. Would, are you going to come, Blue Bear, or are you gonna keep working on your drawing? It's fine to keep working, and you can still listen to the story from your table. When Blue Bear is done, she puts the work away. Where does, okay, that goes on the shelf. Where does your paper go? Okay, that goes in its spot. Now what would you like to do, Blue Bear? Oh, you hear that some friends started getting a lesson on the computer from their teacher? You can join too. If someone's doing something interesting, you can always come and join. You can always come and watch. Some of the time, the teacher won't be able to hear what you're saying, but if you want to join and you have something that you want to say, you can raise your hand or raise your finger so she can see. Okay, when it's time to say goodbye at the end of the open work time, the teacher will make this sound again. and everybody can put their work away and come sit down again to say goodbye. If you need to leave before then, that's okay, Blue Bear, but you do need to have your parent with you or let them know if you're going to the bathroom or getting a snack. Have a good day, Blue Bear.